Hey everyone, this is Manly Badass Hero, and welcome back to Return, One Way Trip. Previously, we entered the train, but we're still not sure if that was a good or bad decision. Fresh water for the sleeping car. There's not a lot left. Fresh roses. I hope Kyo likes them. Five fresh friggin' roses in a vase. I really can't just barge into any random room. Who do you think we are? We're the main character. To command. Mr. Morris. Hmm. Not now, son. Your mother is resting. I'm sorry, father. You see, I've misplaced my composition book. and may have left it in there. Lost it again, did you? I swear, you'd replace your own head if it wasn't stuck to your neck. Yes, I suppose you're right, father. Maybe it's a sign, son, to give up your fanciful notion of becoming a classical music composer and join me in the family business. But this is my dream, father. Dreams are something we all wake up from, son. It's only a matter of time. Foreshadowing. It'd be rude of me to disturb this cabin's occupants. Just use your money and bother whoever one you want. Who are you? Oh! My goodness. I'm so sorry. Think nothing of it. I really must pay more attention. Huh. I have the same problem. Allow me to introduce myself. I'm A.G. Morris. Oh. Are you related to Edmund Morris? The Morris that owns this train line. The guilty has charged. And may I ask your name? Oh, of course. I'm Minako Matsumoto, although you might recognize my maiden name more readily, Tachibana. Indeed, the Tachibanos are titans of industry. Or so says my father. I trust you are enjoying the journey. Indeed, this is quite the luxurious train. Now if you excuse me, I realize I've left my cabin without my necklace. Certainly. Enjoy the rest of your journey. Thank you. A pleasure meeting you, AJ. Likewise. I bet you the cabins look the same. So I need to go in here if I could. He did pop back out, huh? Just because my father owns this train doesn't mean I can go where I please. On the contrary. We can. All you gotta do is just click open that door and be like, Money! And just throw bills out. Everyone will be okay with it. And be like, what are you doing? Like, Buddy, and then just like, all right, fine, you can stay. What's happening? Where am I? I'm sorry, sir. I didn't mean to. How did I get here? Where is everyone? Are you all right, sir? Do you require assistance? Go away. Leave me alone. Is that one of the guys? As you wish. That was odd. I trust you're having a pleasant journey, Master Morris. A elegant water dispenser filled to the brim of fresh, clear ice water. Water. I have my doll, Mommy. Oh, I didn't see the janitor bring it. He didn't. One of my ghost friends found it for me. You and your imagination. You know Mommy doesn't like when you talk about imaginary friends. But they're not imaginary. I do hope you grow out of this soon. You're worrying Mommy. As soon as I sell these babies, son, I'll be able to buy this train line right out from under your father's nose. Just so wait and see. Oh, uh, okay. Why are you sitting alone? Where are your parents? Mommy just went back to our cabin. But it's okay, I'm all grown up and they leave me on my own all the time. Hmm. Your father owns this train, doesn't he? Well, maybe he can bring me some tea. In fact, have it brought to my room, then I won't have to look at that creepy little girl and her poorness. There's something off about that one. She's not right. In defense of the, uh, the old lady, she's probably right. Because <laughs> that little girl might very well be the villain. Hey, there's a note stuck behind this picture. Scavenger Hunt Clue 1. 
Isn't that for the uh, the ever couple? Take note of what surrounds you here, and you will find my token, dear. How can a clue be both the next you find yet still be found out of order? It's a riddle, and a scavenger hunt. I wonder where it will lead. Hey, one of those slips of paper is in a food order. Yeah, see, out of order. Of course, it's the next clue. But I found it out of order among the food orders. What's next? Your prize remains the clues. Two clues away, rather. If you can solve the next riddle without delay, they say birds of a feather flock together. During the day, so should flowers. Hmm, where's a day? Toilet. My, the water in the bowl looks so clean. I'm most tempted to drink it. Oh, come to think of it, maybe not. This toilet looks too luxurious to use. Getting a weird feeling from this room, huh? A vase with fresh cut flowers. Some are white and one is orange. Smell flowers. Put lovely flowers. This orange one is out of place. Now we're gonna switch them out. This might be the next clue. I don't know how this would activate a piece of paper. Okay, that does not make sense. To you, heart, I soon will tend. This loving quest is near an end. You'll find your prize at the end of sleep. It'd be awkward if he's waiting at the end of the scavenger hunt. It's like he's waiting for his wife and you show up. Oh no. What if he's like in a rose bed or something? Almost done. Hmm. What could the end of sleep mean? A bed. Huh? We actually used it? Boy, father spared no expense, even for the toilets. Is that handle gold-plated? Oops, I broke it. I better take this handle back to the porter and let him know it needs to be repaired. Hey! What the? What was that? Who was that? That girl, she looked familiar. And I felt almost like I was looking at myself. What could that mean? Ignore it, IG. It was nothing. Mother always warned you not to let your imagination get the best of you. I broke something made out of gold. Can you take it from me? <laughs> I'm afraid this just snapped off one of the toilets in the day cabin. It will need to be repaired. Right away, Master Morris. Thank you for bringing it to my attention. Pockets it. <laughs> the end of sleep. It's gotta be one of these rooms. Are you okay in this, sir? Hmm, no answer. Haiku 2. Of course, this is the far end of the sleeper car. The end of sleep. Your starlight warms me. A puny mound of gray earth. 
shine on me always. Such longing, such love. Oh, if only my music was as powerful. This must be the work of that janitor. Perhaps he would allow me to marry these words of my music. I must find him. Oh, my music. I completely forgot that I was looking for my composition book. The real couple's gonna be the janitor, <laughs> AG. So I'm like, your music's really good. Well, your your poetry's real good. Let's let's mix the two together. AG. Yes, father. There you are. Only you could get lost and train the small. Not lost. I'm doing scavenger hunts, Dad. Your mother needs her medicine. Or have you forgotten her long of your precious composition book? Of course, Father, right away. I can't believe I forgot about Mother. Okay, I just need to collect it and take it to her room. Mother's medications. So many of them. I do hope this trip provides the cure that has been promised. I want my Mother back. Happy thoughts, AG. Happy thoughts. I'll need to bring Mother some water as well. There's some just at the end of this car. Was this one almost empty? No. Blast, no water. I can get some of the dining car. Here we are. And there we go. Water. I can bring Mother a medicine now. Hey. Oh, Miss Minako. Is everything all right? Oh, um, yes. I was just on my way to the dining car. I saw you and... Pardon me, but I'm late giving my mother her medicine. I do look forward to chatting another time. Yes, yes, of course. On your way. Don't interrupt me when I'm talking, boy. You should know better. Now get that medicine to your mother immediately. I like to imagine you sound like... Ufer from, uh, Warcraft 3. You're a fine lad, AG. Caring for your mother like that. Now get your medicine to your mother, boy. Here we are. Glad you can make it, Oop Morris. Mother, it's AG. There's my boy. I'm sorry I'm late, Mother. I became distracted. Of course you did. Well, I'm no worse for wear. I'm glad. Here is your medicine. Hello, Ki- I mean, Miss Kiyo. Master Eiji. Kiyo's been keeping me company while you were wandering the train with my medicine. She is good company, Mother, if you know what I mean. Indeed. Her struggles growing up in Suno Hazu are heartbreaking. Her mother must be a saint. As are all mothers, Mother. Ye. Correct, son. We are so lucky to have Kiyo in our family now. I'm grateful, Mistress. You showed in your dedication to serving this family, Kiyo, and I want you to know how much we appreciate you. Thank you, Mistress. Now run along. I need to take my medicine and speak with my son. Of course, Mistress. M Master Eiji. I'll see you later, Miss Kiyo. Remember, son, fawn over the help every so often. It makes them feel more guilty when they steal from you. Mother, Miss Kia would never... You never know. Good to take precautions here and there. Now give me that medication already. Of course, Mother. And while I'm taking it, why don't you tell me about the girl who's recently caught your fancy? Uh-oh. You're... You're imagining things, Mother. Nonsense. When you're stuck in bed all day, you tend to notice every little detail. And you've been a little more absent-minded than usual lately. Much more dedicated to writing your music. Clearly, someone has inspired you. Well, yes, it's true. If you must know. Oh, don't tell me. Let me guess. It's all a sickly woman like me has. Don't be mel melodramatic, mother. 
You'll be cured in Kyoto. I know it. Such a loyal son. So, let me guess. Hmm. You started acting like this before the trip. Mother? Hush, let me guess. You know your mother is an eagle eye. Could it be the Busujima girl you met at Kala this spring? She was lovely, and from a very affluent family. Mother, stop! No, oh, hmm. Well, what about... Relax. Barely any blood came up this time. Don't move. I'll bring Dr. Clark. Dr. Clark. Father, mother is having a terrible coughing fit. Fear not, son. I'll look after her. Perhaps if you hadn't taken so long to bring out medicine. Now, now, Edmund. Don't be so hard on the boy. It's your wife we should be attending to. Of course. Eiji, wait. Yes, Kyo. What is it? Mother's taking a bad turn. I'm sorry to hear that, but I've brought your composition book. You found it. The porter brought it to me. Apparently it fell under one of the dining tables. Of course. Eiji, your mother told me she thought you were in love with someone. It didn't seem like she suspected that I was the object of your affections. No. But she started taking guesses. Stabs in the dark. Did... did you tell her? Of course not. I couldn't. Especially with her in such a delicate condition. But that's exactly why you should. Maybe after the train trip. I know this is difficult for you, A.G. But your mother may not have much time left. Let her know that her son is in love and happy. It may ease some of her pain. Don't say that. She'll be fine. There's plenty of time. But what if there isn't? I... What? What's that? Bombs. But this route was supposed to be far away from the conflict. Father assured me we were going to be safe. Ah! Is that the transition to the modern age? Let's see. Is there a thing where, like, both errors are kind of semi-linked and trapped? Do you have some kind of commonality, maybe? Saki? Saki! What if the twist is that this age doesn't exist? This is all a dream of the people in the past who are technically actually the present. Deconstruction. Saki, wake up. What? Kane. Yes, it's me. Take it slow. How did I get here? Beats me. It's like you were sleepwalking. Really. I mean, I remember walking through the train, but it wasn't me. It must have been a doozy of a dream, I guess. Fuck, you never snap out of it. I was shaking for like five minutes. How did you find me? Where have you been? Hard to say, to tell you the truth. Anyhow, we came out here, me, Kazuki, and Sen. And we got split up. Not quite sure how that happened. Sen, he's with you. Where is he? That's the thing. We got separated. But there's something about this train. It's somehow like, I don't know, a maze. One minute we were together, and the next everyone's gone. I was headed back to camp, and there you were, sleepwalking or whatever. It was creepy. We never did find Yuta. About that. Yuta. Oh no. Kane. Yuta. He, he's... He's... What about Yuta? I found him. He's dead. What? No, it can't be. Maybe you dreamed it or something. Actually, I don't know. No, it's true. We were too hard on him. I should have let you guys go after him sooner. It's my fault. Nonsense. Yuta's fine. He's got to be. No, he's not. Come with me, I'll show you. First, I'm gonna look this way. So I can kind of see, because I went back and rewatched my demo video, I can kind of see where the first demo is like a mix of like maybe the first half of the game, heavily abbreviated.
The food they prepared back there smelled so good. Actually, skip that dialogue. But she was just basically saying like, oh yeah, it smelled good, blah blah blah. I remember the, the past. I can just barely see myself in these platters. When they were new and polished, it was like looking in a mirror. This is where I found the little girl's doll. It helped me find Utah. What little girl? It's... it's not important now. Broken. Huh. Being in the woods is a luxury compared to this dump. This whole train was beautiful before. Before all this. I'm sure it was. I know it was. Okay, okay. I'm sorry, let's get out of here. Well, it's in this cozy. Not. I can see a million of me in that broken mirror. Prepare yourself. It's pretty horrible. I really hope you imagine this. Oh geez, Saki, you had me so scared. But he was here, hanging. If it were anyone else, I'd be angry. But you're not the choking kind. I swear, I know what I saw. I believe you. You may just not have seen what you think you saw. Come to think of it, it was probably Utah just trying to get back at us. Can't say that I blame him. It was so real. I'm sure it was. Utah likes authentic scares. And look, he left a rose behind. Probably never signed that this was all a joke of some sort. Let's head back to camp. We need to rest. Especially you. Where did this rose come from? It's right under where Yuda was hanging. What is going on here? Wow, it's so dark out there. The reflection is really clear. Huh. A crack in the wall. I wonder what that leads to. Gordon Freeman! Sad. Ready to head back to camp? Yeah, you're right. I need to rest. That's my girl. I'm sure if we stay in this train any longer, I'll start seeing things too. No. Go to the far right. Secrets. Damn. What the hell is that thing? It's... it's what led me to Utah. And it's real. You can see it now I'm worried again that Yuta, that he's really dead after all. Keep it together, Saki. It's a hanging doll. When Yuta left, it clearly upset you and you've been well seeing things. Maybe this doll and everything else got jumbled up in your brain. I'm not gonna be able to leave. What is that? Is that even real? I don't even want to know. This train is starting to freak me out. There we go. Here it begins. Hey. What's wrong? The door won't open. Something's blocking it. Looks like boulders are blocking the door. Damn earthquakes. Yeah. What's the deal with those? I don't know. Weird. Maybe this is a volcanic area or something. Maybe. But you'd think we'd have known that. Or Sen had found this out when he planned the trip. After his performance at the campfire over that poem, I don't know what to tell you about Sen anymore. Never mind. Let's head back to the toward the front of the train again. People run to the others if they didn't make it out before the door became locked. There's got to be another way out of this train. Uh oh. This is worse than before. What is it, Saki? I don't know, but I've been trying to tell you. Ah! 
What the hell? Look, it's open to a new page. When you see yourself, is it yourself you see or a monster who bites? What a creepy poem. What could it mean? Boulders upon the nearest side of this door. Huh. I can just see my reflection in the window. Kind of scary, actually. Uh oh. Oni mask. Chikakami. Chikami mask. Where did that come from? A reflection somehow. A mask depicting a horrible demon with three bloody fangs. Hmm. I feel like it's a puzzle solution. Because it's very specific. The door is jammed and now sports bloody gouges. A rusted needle juts out from the moon. There's three cuts. Uh oh, it's jammed too. I don't like the look of those. Three bloody scratches mark the door. So you gotta use the mask and the reflection. Well, that worked. We can open the door now. What is all this? Take mask. Okay, so you have to leave the mask there. Then why give us the option to take it? Is that gonna come up later? I wonder who this belonged to. The train's janitor. He was quite handsome, really. He was on his honeymoon, actually, and... What? How could you know that? Oh, I... Forget it. I don't want to know. Now you're starting to freak me out. <laughs> what was that? It stuck shut behind us. How did that happen? What are we going to do? Hmm. There's a nail to, to hang something. And no scratches. I have an idea. An idea that the next door is sealed shut too. Yep, come on. Let's see if our reflection holds the key again. Useless. Useless. Here we go. <laughs> Otoko mask. It happened again. This is too weird. Wait, does it say there was a nail or no? So no scratches because no fangs here. Pick through the glass. Fang. That's gonna be used to repair a mask. You want me to step outside and give you some privacy? No, I just wanted to see if the handle was still here. Okay, there it is. Now that's going to do you any good. Let's head out. Get our mask here. There we go. The mask falls to the floor. Uba mask. There's never mask. How can you be so calm about this? Oh. 
Oh, two masks. Bugaku mask. Looks kind of like Hanuman. Here we go. I, I just can't. Four scratches. A bunch of them on this one. Chris mask hangs in the door. <laughs> oh, I have to go get a uh, a tooth in like one of the other areas. Hmm. This is the one of a missing fang. So we can switch it out with this one. See. Nope, they didn't want to put it over there. Whoops. Put this one here that has three of them. And then we're going to basically go completely in reverse. Bring this uh, Oni mask. Over there, put the last tooth in, giving us four claw marks. Fine clicks in the mask mouth, it's complete now. He seemed very happy. I can just barely see myself on these planners. And ooh, a new mask. Oh, there we go. There's that famous mask. Hanya. This mask, it's terrifying. I don't know how you can even touch it. Yep, we did bad. Saki, what's happening? Ah! Apparently I was very angry and smashed every single of her mask. Is it gone? I think so. The door, it's returned to normal. No bloody gashes, nothing. What just happened? We'll go crazy trying to figure this one out. Let's just get out of here. Hi, I do. Saki, what the hell is that? Run. Let's get out of here.
go on. There we go. Well, we ain't going back in that one. Hope that thing doesn't show up again. Weird, I can't interact with any of these doors. Where is everyone? I don't know. Hopefully back at the campsite. You don't think those things got them, do you? We can't think about that. Don't go ahead! How did I get here? Where is everyone? Did you hear that? Go away, leave me alone! That sound like Sen, come on! What? Oh god. Saki! Help me, Kane. I'm slipping. What the hell is that? Kane, please. Saki. Help her out. I'm hitting E. There you go. Phew, thanks, Kane. What the hell is that? Is that hell? Hell do I know? I don't know. This is an ordinary terrain. You think? Look, seriously, I don't know what to think anymore. Are you hurt? I'm fine. I don't know what would have happened to me if I'd fallen. Don't even go there. Let's just get away from that thing. Good call. Besides, we have to get to Sen. Sen, it's Saki. I'm here with Kane, we're here. No one. You went back in time. Sen? The room is empty. You're not gonna try out to be a ghost too, are you? Are you in there, Sen? He's... He's not here. I'm dead on my feet, Saki. Can we take a quick breather, please? Hopefully not literally dead on your feet. But you heard him too, didn't you? He was here. I heard something. I don't know which way is up anymore. Sit with me a moment. Let's stop and try to sort things out. Together. I guess you're right. Hmm? What's wrong, Kane? You're trembling. Maybe a little. You can't fall apart. What happened to me if you do that? I need you. Huh. I wish. What are you talking about? You're the strong one. I look up to you. Oh, Saki, if only... If only what? If only, well, a lot of things. For one, if only I hadn't gotten us all into this mess. I don't understand. Whatever happened to Yuta, it's not your fault, it's mine. That note, I wrote it for you. Ah, someone in the comments was right. Someone put out that theory in the last video comments. What? Yep, me, for you. It's how I really feel about you. How you feel about me. But you and Kazuki. I like Kazuki just fine, but it's always been you. But I've been a coward. I know how to tell you. Everything I've done was to stare near you. To make you like me. To wait till I found an opening. Basically. Everything Sen accused Yuta of doing. So, it dropped off your backpack. Yep, but I wasn't ready to admit it. Dang it, Kane. So I didn't stop you from putting in Sen's backpack. And I still wasn't ready when Sen attacked Yuta. I just wanted to run and hide in the tent. So Yuta ran away and we all split up and now I don't know what is going on in this weird train. But still, all I can think of you is, is you. And now, now I picked the time to tell you how I feel. When we're trapped. I hope you'll forgive. But it's not just you, Sen, Kazuki, and especially Yuta. I have to beg all of you for forgiveness. But you're not looking up to me now. It is kind of awkward. Especially, you know, considering what might have happened to Yuta. Look. You don't have to say anything. But I'm going to, look. This will be fine, eventually. Let's just get out of here first, deal? Deal. Oh. 
time warp. Hey, ow! I I'm sorry, I didn't mean... No, it's not you. I'm sitting on something. It's burning. Pendant. This is Sens. I gave it to him for his birthday this year. Then maybe he was here after all. But where did it go? Oh, it's burning again. How can that be? I don't know. It feels like... like a warning. Run. Never earthquake. How you doing? Saki, he's back again. Let's go. Hurry! Chapter 6. The Third. What the? Kane! Kane, are you okay? Are you in there? Saki, is that you? Maybe the masks represent the characters. Each one is wearing a mask for some reason, all trying to hide something in their life. Sen? Sen! Yes, he was stuck in the past. Oh no, I'm back in the other train again. Saki, what's going on? Where are we? I don't know that where is right now is a question. Just let me in and I will figure it out. I can't. The door's jammed. Or locked from the other side. You have to get me out of here, Saki. The janitor seems to have keys. Let me see if I can get them from him. Hurry, Saki. I've been seeing some weird things. Some anime we're not supposed to be talking about. I'll be right back. <coughs> How dare you! I feel all I've done for you! No, mistress. You're taking this all wrong. Am I? You tramps are all alike. Think you can get your hooks in your nice gentle rich boy like my son. Please, mistress. My feelings are sincere. They are... <coughs> Calm yourself, mistress. I'll fetch Dr. Clark. Don't bother. You don't like a work for me. You just missed. Mistress, no, I... Get out. You whore. I told you not to tell her yet. This is not real good timing. This isn't over, Mother Morris. This isn't over at all. You old witch, we'll see what your son has to say about this. When the mask was a witch. That's what I'm saying. The mask represent the, the actors. That doesn't sound good at all. I myself on my cabin. Can you please open the door? My apologies, sir. The porter has the cabin keys at this time. Now am I going to get back into my cabin? I can't sit eating soap in this place into our trip. The porter is in the back of the train right now. I'll fetch the keys immediately. Sorry for the inconvenience. Lock myself out. Can't blame my walls for that, I guess. I don't trust you, little girl. What are you going in there for? I feel like you're... You're behind something here. Oh, hi, ghost friend. Look at the lighting. It's like a stage play. Ah, uh, hi. What's wrong, little girl? That's it! Like I said, it's stage play symbolism. It's like, uh... There's never a um, horror game I've played. It's, it's a Russian one. 
but that one also had stage play symbolism. Uh, that one had to do with a uh, some kind of plague and something like that. But maybe, maybe Ayumi is staging a play with all their souls. Maybe not a literal play, but almost literal play. Like she's manipulating them all. I told you my name was Ayumi. Sorry, Ayumi. What's wrong? I lost another doll. Oh, that's not really a doll. And I didn't quite lose it. What do you mean, Ayumi? I was showing the little boy on the train my Bunraku puppet. And he was being such a, a whoop boy. So I left it with him. See, there was a Bunraku mask. But now I want it back. I'm sure you just ask him. No, you need to get it from him. Please? Be my ghost friend and get my puppet back for me? I don't want to see that poopy head boy anymore. Sure, I'll try. Where is he? He's with his mommy in the next car back. Okay, Ayumi. Don't worry, I got this. That's where the old lady is. Hey, that's my room. Stay out. Hmm. A large, complex puppet that looks too fragile for the way the little boy's playing with it. Lower your voice. That gentleman is trying to concentrate. Wish look, mother. It's a soaring samurai. Just need to do some ghost stuff to scare him away. I think I have this melody right, but the piano feels out of tune for some reason. See, I'm on the top of the piano. It's a big glimpse from inside the little piano. Let me just... Okay. <laughs> Utility locker. Fire extinguisher. Here's that book. What do you mean I have to come to dining car to get a cup of tea? That's where our food is served, madame. Aha, the porter. And he's holding the key ring. Don't you madame me. It's a luxury excursion, isn't it? Luxury means that whatever I want comes to me, not the other way around. Of course, madame. Uh, certainly. I will bring you tea right away. That's more like it. Oh no, he's holding that key ring tight. I'll have to get him to drop it to get that key away from him. How can I get him to drop those keys? He seems a skittish type. Maybe I can stall him to dropping them. I better look around, see if I can find anything that will do the trick. Child's drawing flutters in the crack of the door. Pretty piano. A sad tune opens his heart. And hearts hold the key. Hmm. Looks like we're gonna go need to get a piano key. <laughs> Here, take this crowbar. It'll solve your problem. How can I get these two to leave the puppet behind, even for a few seconds? It's not meant to be played with that way. You don't want to break it now, do you? How will I get it from them? I could scare them away by moving the puppet and having them think it's come to life. Or I could distract them. I guess I'll try scaring them. What good is being a ghost friend if you can't act like a ghost once in a while? Oh, oh crap! Oopsie! Now look what you've done. You've broken it. But mom, I didn't. Pardon me, madame, but I'm trying to work, and your dear son has interrupted me several times already. My apologies, sir. Apology accepted, but I'm afraid I must finish my work. I will be keeping this for now, and will give it back when I'm done. Yes, of course. 
But ma... Hush. Please do continue. My boy will not disturb you again. Thank you, madame. No, give me back the... Oh, God. But I didn't do anything. You're a terror sometimes, young man. What would that little girl say when she finds you broken her toy? It's not like I can afford to buy another one. But I... No, never word. It didn't work. I have to get the puppet's body from the little boy. And it's said from that young man. And I still need to get the key from the porter to get sent out of that room. Hello, son. Are you winning? Edgy Morse, you're a disgrace. You're not winning at all. Father, what is the meaning of this? Lower your voice. We're not the only ones in this car. Don't you tell me to lower my voice, boy. This is my train. I can free you off my train if I so desire. Father, please. You come right this minute, you little chambermaid. Here. So it's true. Oh, she told you a dirty little secret to your mother. You almost killed her. Mother! Come along right now, son. We're gonna sort this all out. The three of us. Of course, father. Let me gather my piano. Leave it. You're on a train. No one's gonna steal your infernal piano. March, boy, march! I said march, boy! Things just keep on happening. Money sure didn't buy that family happiness. What, mother? Hush, and just keep playing with that handless doll. That poor boy and that girl. How sad for them both. Play a sad song. Mother, did you hear some piano music? Why do you think that piano is playing by itself? I don't know I could do that. Never did I. Looks like an ordinary enough toy piano. Can we go see, Mother? Please. Well, all right. But just don't touch anything unless you'd like to answer to that young man's father. Not at all, Mother. I'll stand back. I just want to see. All right. Let's go sneak a look. Free doll. Here's my chance. Got it. Huh. It's not doing anything. This is boring. Let's go back to our seats. <laughs> Alright, now I just see hearts. I don't see like a hint what I'm supposed to be doing with the piano yet? I might have one, I don't know yet. But let's keep moving. Yeah, sorry about the doll. Where's my puppet? I want my puppet! Oh, it's that handsome janitor. Is he crying? Oh, God. I've lost her. Her heart is with someone else, but I've tried so hard to make her happy. Without her love, I, I just don't know what the point of living is. Let them bomb us to hell. This is just a depressing train. Wow, he was, uh, was he upset? He left such a mess. And he didn't even lock the trash bin, he was so distracted. Yuck, all this garbage. Hey, what's this? Sorry, page two. He was the light of my life, but the light has dimmed. Was he truly ever my light, or just a sunspot? I need more than light, I need flame. Someone new to nurture the Emperor now burning within me, and he will be mine before our journey ends. No wonder he was so upset. He's discovered he's losing his wife, and perhaps much more than that. So did she see AG, and Lily's like, all right, he's mine, I'm gonna switch off? All this garbage on the floor. He must have really been upset. 
Hey, what's this? Family badass hero. Huh. Squadron closing in. Stop. Make emergency preparations. Stop. Keep everyone calm. Stop. So they did get bombed. Oh no. Did someone try to hide this telegraph? We need to get to the portal right away. If I bring tea to the woman right now, I'll be tempted to just spill it on her. Nice. I better wait till I calm down. Where'd this telegraph come from? Squadron. Oh no, this is terrible. I have to tell the chief engineer. He dropped his key ring. Hmm, only one key. I hope this will open Sen's room. He seems so conflicted. It must be tough to have to choose between your mother and someone you love. The sounds of a horrible argument can be heard through the door. Oh my goodness. Such anger. See this key works? I got the key, Sen. Hurry, Saki. It didn't work. Will you just get me out of here already, Saki? I'm trying. I'll go look for the right key. I'm sure it's here somewhere. I still have to get the piece of Yami's doll that the young man took from earlier. Maybe I can check his room. Maybe the key's for that. The right key's probably in that piano. I'll tell you that right now. Aha! Let's check it out. Composition page of a short melody. There we go. What a beautiful tune, but so melancholy. Henry and Haiku. Sad Haiku. Our mountain of love has become the sheerest cliff. Our hearts tumble down. It looks like the young man was trying to write a sad tune to fit the poem. Hey, the head from my used puppet isn't here. I saw that young man take it. Where could it be with him? Ooh, future ghosts, ignore me. Hurry, before someone sees you. Oh, Kyo, why did you do that? You may have ruined everything. Oh, do you not love me any longer because I revealed our affair to your mother? Of course not. I didn't mean that, I... Then what's ruined? It's just that you've made things more difficult. You had terrible timing. No, Eiji. You're the one making things difficult. If you can't stand up for yourself, then stand up for me. For us. I... I will, just not now. You can, and you will. You march back... Mmm, you sound unlike his dad. I agreed never to see you again. You... what? Take it back, Eiji. Take it back. I will. Just not now. Let's get to Kyoto. Get some space to breathe and... You need to make a decision, Eiji. Your parents are me. Mark my words, Eiji Morris. If you don't make that decision soon, there will be no Kyoto for us. Kyo! Kyo. Oof. This is... Some drama going down. Feels kind of bad. I'm just kind of like spying on these people. Those two have troubles, but so do I. I still need to find a key to get sent out of that room. And I promise that you might have returned her puppet intact. I better head toward the back of the train. I'm sure I'll find what I'm looking for. But yeah. Bad timing. I wait. I wait till at least she's gone to the doctor. And isn't so stressed out about possibly dying. <laughs> Then, then, then maybe she could take the shock a little better. Triangle, 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 circle, triangle, diamond, star, circle, triangle. Okay, it was triangle.
Top of the piano springs open. There's a key tucked beneath the strings. Looks like this will open Sen's room. I better hurry. I still need the doll head. Man, this whole thing's just gonna end up one chain tragedy. Oh man, I can feel it. I'm seeing it. I smell it, I feel it. I'm seeing it. It's going down. Maybe Sen's gonna help us find the doll head. Sen, with the right key this time. I'm sure of it. No response. Sen? He's already gone back to the future. Sen, where did you go? Sen. Dollhead? Sen, are you back there? Watch out. What? Why, it... It's a head of Hayabi's puppet. How did it get here? Where did Sen go? There was nowhere to go. I might as well take this back to Ayumi. Maybe she can tell me something about Sen. She seems like she knows things. That boy broke it! Where's his head? It needs a head. What? You said you'd bring my puppet. I meant the whole thing. Yeah, hey, give me a second to put it all together. There. Did it. Let me teach you how to perform of a Bunraku puppet. I can't really. I don't have time. I... Sure, you have all the time in the world. You know, really, I'd love to play, but I need to find my fiancé, Sen. Have you seen him? Can you help me find him? Ayumi? Ayumi! Oh. I'm sure you'll find him. You're good at finding things. Yeah. And losing them. Especially my friends. Please play with me. That boy was so mean. I want someone nice to play with. I can't. Sin might be in danger. I think we're all in danger. And Yuta. Come on. Play with me. And maybe I can help you. You know where Sen is. I said maybe. But you gotta play with me first. You need more than one person to perform Bunraku. Okay, fine. Just tell me what to do. Yay. Hold this. You work the legs, I'll do the body, and there. I'm not sure what to do here. Nothing yet. Just wait. What for? Can you at least tell me where Sen is? Sen's the puppet. Huh? I don't know. Don't be cross, but I just said that so that you could play with me. Great, fine, but I really need to go. Is the head in the other arm supposed to drop like that? No, you need to free people for a Bunraku puppet. Oh, then I guess we can't really play after all. That's what we're waiting for, silly. What? <laughs> what was that? I told you. The third puppeteer. What? Chapter 7, Crimson Now where am I? Looks like I'm back. That thing, what was that thing in the puppet? So cold, so angry, and yet so sad. It, it touched me and I could feel all of that. That little girl, Ayumi, she's behind this, I can feel it. But there's something else, the third, as Ayumi called it. Something dark, something evil. That's what is behind Ayumi. Kane. I think about the Kane. Huh. Bottles? Another earthquake. The pendant. It's not just warm, it's burning. Ow. Ghosts! It, it's like a warning. Th that's the wife of the janitor. I better get out of here. 
It's happening again. And the pendant... Uh, something else is coming. Oh god, it's a ghostly lover spat. It's Ghost Choice Breaker. Oh no, I'm trapped. Listen, you two gotta work this out. Now, I'll invite you on this show, the Manly Bass Hero Show. Now, you're a janitor. Your wife says you ain't paying attention to her. Also, you're both dead, and you got hit by a bombing raid. Fine, okay. But, have you thought about listening to her, you know, her complaints a little bit? Maybe, you know, maybe a little compromise. And you, your husband's working hard. You gotta, like, you know, give him a little bit of leeway there. You gotta, like, you know, know it's some tough times. You gotta have a little patience. This, this is common in early couples. Now, you gotta stop fighting. You gotta stop the ghost and whale thing. You gotta stop floating there. Move on. I mean, literally move on. Go to heaven. Get the hell out of here. Now, we can do this. We can do this. You know, you all agree on the show. So just everyone relax. You get these bottles. Why is Sense Pendant getting warm again? Where did these bottles come from? A pile of antique bottles. I bet if I pay attention, I can use a pen to locate things I couldn't find before. The ball smashes into a million pieces against the boulder. The janitor was very serious about his duties. You could never let a mess like this just sit here. It's working. I hate you! He's never going to come over here. Maybe a rose over here. Get okay, these two to meet in the middle. Oh, I might be a ghost, but I have cleaning standards. There, now hopefully I can find something to get his wife to go away. I'm so worried about Kane. The pen is getting warm. I'm just sitting on here under this under this tablecloth. Challenge strong. I watch over them. So that they watch over me. Are we strong enough? No, no! I said no, I'm not going back! I need to find something to get the ghosts out of my way so I can save my friend. I don't know what you want from me, but it will have to wait. Deal with it. Sunglasses on. Fine, jeez. I think I've had enough of this. I'm not going to sneak around anymore. Do you hear me? 